I'll be unboxing all five cake versions of Red Velvet's new album, The Red Velvet Festival 2022 Birthday. So I finally got all five versions. I previously did an unboxing of the Irene and Silky version, but for this video, I will open all of them up and show the inclusions and the photo card pulls that we will get. But first, I'm going to take off the plastic wrapping of each of these albums. I'll go through these in age order. Let me show each side of the album. This is the pink version, the pink cake version. So this is Irene's member color. Has a candle and a slot to put it in. These are lyrics and credits and each track shows the member cake versions so you could kind of see how it would look like if you saw the cake in real life looks very delectable then we get circular photos of the member Gorgeous leader Irene. She seriously has like some vampire genes going on because she's still like if you told me she's a fourth generation idol, I would believe you. Recently there was a Christmas SM collab with Espa and Red Velvet, and I swear it's like Girls Generation 2.0. Like even though there's Espa members probably like 10 years younger than Irene, she blends right in. So I would believe you if you told me that's the new fourth generation girl group of SM. <laughs> but um, I have to watch a music video. It was released this morning and I'm loving the combination of leader Karina with leader Irene. So I can't wait to see like what SM gives us in an album, well the upcoming album inclusions and photo cards and merch hopefully because yeah, gotta love Red Velvet and Espa. Love seeing the senior, junior group interactions and collabs. Like, got the beat. So iconic. So I like this look on Irene because um, she definitely could be glamorous, but when she has more of the casual look, oh, it's definitely charming. Here's the unit photo. So that was the circular photos. Here is the CD. So the bottom of it is a pink disc. Same material as the photos over here. Um, and it's placed on a foam. There's the cat. Now I'm going to put the candle into the slot that you have to pop out, place it into the slot, and it makes a cake. Cute. And our photo card pool is Wendy doing the half heart shape on her face. Everyone's photo cards this era. Oh my god, they're like all freaking beautiful. And now the next member of the Uni line is Silgi. The outer plastic case is pretty much the same. Here's Silgi's 
Her member color is yellow. So we've got a yellow cake with sprinkles. Same logo at the bottom. Put the photo card to the side over there. Once again, we get the candle and the top portion to place the candle in. The same lyrics and credits page of their five tracks. All of them are amazing, sounds wonderful. No skip album. So. Unit. I like the chaotic mess in this photo shoot. It's just like super creepy, but also has like a cool aesthetic to it. So this comeback, the style is kind of like, like a fusion of punk and early Y2K Asian girl style with the leg warmers and the kawaii culture. Cute fashion pieces and accessories. For example, Yeti in one of their performances is wearing like a black Hello Kitty shirt paired with like, I think like fishnet stockings. So it kind of has all those different styles going on. But they really could pull off that concept. See like the black nail polish, that chain link necklace, and like the arm sleeve. So yeah loving their styling this comeback. I guess this would be considered their red side. Yeah, they could basically pull off any kind of look. And genre music. Her velvet is just so great. So that was Silky's um, photo, circular photo set. The CD's the same. The disc holder at the bottom is yellow. Look at that again. So I have to pop out that candle slot every time. It's kind of tough sometimes. Then I'm going to put the candle there and build the sulgi cake. This packaging is like, give it five stars. It's so cute. Oh, the photo card pull for the Silky version. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> Silky! Personally, I really like this card. I saw there's a variation of this outfit in another photo card. Um, one of their pre-order benefits, so I'm gonna have to go through that later. Oh, perfect. The Silky version had the Silky photo card. Next in the uni line is Wendy. This is my first time seeing it, so you could see the details of the sprinkles. Her version has like stars and a lot more sprinkles versus the previous one, Silky's. So this cake definitely has more of a sprinkle and frosting. We saw this already. So gorgeous. And Wendy is so talented, like from debut era, she already had like the strongest voice, typical of SM vocalists, definitely like a standard for SM. But um, yeah, if you look at the behind the scenes recording, you could see how much attention to detail she has to the vocal layering and how much of an integral member she is. Without Wendy's vocals, it cannot be called a Red Velvet song. So yeah, I've always really liked her vocals. She's like one of my top favorite vocalists in SM. Abs, abs, abs. And she's so confident. I love how she grew into like a confident lady over the years 
And she's like so funny. You could definitely tell she, she's like the mood maker comedian of the group. So every time you watch Red Velvet variety shows, you'll see how much she makes all the members laugh. So I feel like she definitely is the glue of the group. So I'm so glad she's like back on stage after <laughs> the accident that took Psycho live performances away from bands. Oh my gosh. But I'm glad she's like 100% recovered and she's able to sing and dance 100%. You could definitely see the passion when she performs. That was the Joy Wendy unit over there. So cute. Again, the chaotic mess and the recipe version photo shoot. Ooh, I've never seen this one. What is that? Green jello. I feel like it should have been blue. <laughs> okay, so there's the CD and you see the blue disc to match Wendy's member color. Okay, I have to kind of like tear it a bit. This one is not placing as easily as the other ones. Okay. So here's the Wendy blue flavor cake. So freaking cute. And if you're wondering about the material, this is not plastic. It's more of like a cardboard casing, like thick cardboard casing with gloss. While this is so it's like cardboard cushion with the styrofoam. This blue one is actually really pretty. Wendy's photo card. Well, the photo card pull for the Wendy blue flavor version is Joy. Cute. So it's my first time seeing these last three um, cake versions. I like the combination of green with pink. It's like there's frosting around and sprinkles. Interesting how there's like some frosting around here too. So here's the back. It's like really snug. It's interesting how it starts with a unit photo. Oops, sorry, Joy. And if you didn't see this before, there's like food in front of them, but it has like a creepy element. There's like a spider over there. For some reason that's pixelated and Joy's hand is in the mystery spaghetti, some clams and the robot from the previous Rebbe festival come back. I wonder if this was placed upside down <laughs> because it didn't start with the member photo but it's fine we could change it up so joy has short hair and bangs for this comeback but probably because she was cast in a drama so probably taken during the same time but she's really um working it Wendy? This should be in the Wendy version, to be honest. <laughs> There's like combat boots on. The bears. I really like um, Joy's vocal tone because she is like, I think she's lead or sub vocalist, probably lead vocalist, but seriously, like every Red Velvet member could pretty much be the main vocalist in any other group but um if you haven't seen it there's a cover of joy that she did 
she sang part of your world from the little mermaid and that really shows how beautiful her vocal tone is she has like a really sweet timber to her voice so definitely an, an integral member of red velvet all of them are they bring something to the group that is unique and unique to them and that's why red velvet is such a great group i'll show the disc for this as well just in case you're wondering beautiful shade of green okay put the candle on this one too no struggle with that here's the green flavor cake the joy version look how pretty that is so cute pull we got for the joy version another sulgi wow i'm getting sulgi a lot this comeback because <laughs> i just did the s mini version i unboxed it two days ago and i got i was expecting to get every member but i got two sulgis it's kind of funny okay so i hope at least in this purple version yuri's version we'll either get a yeti or irene just for variety but Let's see what the photo card gods grant us. And this shade of purple, it's so beautiful. If you look at the lyrics book, it shows how the cake should look like. I guess I'll show it later, but personally I like this version or maybe the pink version. I just think it's designed so well and I would probably try this cake because um, this is like an overhead view. But when you see the actual photo, of course it's a prop, but if it were to be a real cake, it had cherries and like whipped cream around it. I don't know, I like the star sprinkles too in the back. No decorations on the sides. Show it over here. See, this is more of like a 3D view. I definitely would probably try the purple cake or the pink cake. I just think those look the tastiest and the prettiest. The blue one is pretty too with the um, sprinkles. And this is the Magne of the group, Yeti. Let's go through her circular photos. It's so funny with the Espa Red Velvet collab, there's the screenshot I saw of Yeti in between the Espa members and she could totally be in that group. She's like only a year older than Karina and Giselle. So it's kind of funny seeing same age members. It's kind of like when you see Red Velvet Irene with Girls' Generation Suhyun. They're like the same age. Irene is older than some second generation idols. She's actually like the Uni to, I think, like at least more than half of FX members. It's kind of cool how there are idols still active in their 30s and they still look freaking amazing. And, you know, I'm glad that during these past two generations, the seven year curse doesn't apply to girl groups anymore. I hope. I think the order is like not really, it's not always the same. Ooh, that looks really good. But it's different from all five cake versions. Yeah, it looks more like the robot, like with the styling. The um, day one and day two robot. Fishnet tights. So she kind of has somewhat of a punk look too. So after this, I'm totally gonna get some cake. This is making me hungry. <laughs> and they have the camcorder over there. Ooh, that's pretty creepy. The vintage dollhouse. She 
she's holding probably grapes and it's pixelated. Yeah, I'll be here too. The purple stuff. I guess it's not grapes, just random crap. It's pixelated in her member color. Lastly, there you go. See the pretty purple shade of the disc holder. such a cute album our final pull final photo card pull oh okay good so we got four out of five members we got irene leader irene she's actually the member that i mainly collect in this channel so yeah i'm glad to pull her <laughs> i actually have a card on the way because it's not always guaranteed you're gonna get the member you want so i'm glad i pulled my own irene so cute. It's kind of funny seeing like the variety of photo cards. It's not always just like glam. Okay, so that's the photo card pulls and my unboxing for the cake version of Red Velvet's new album, Birthday.